everyone welcome back to my channel so today I will be sharing this six piece collection from light elegance so this is the spice fall 2020 cream collection honestly guys I think all of these colors are so pretty and I'm totally loving this blue so if you'd like to see more in regards to my thoughts and opinions stay tuned Alright guys, so today I will be sharing the Light Elegance Spice Collection. So this was their 2020 fall collection. I know we're in 2021, but I didn't get a chance to share it. And I really did want to share these with you guys. So as always, in typical Light Elegance fashion, this is their cream collection. And it is six-piece collection. So we have Curry On, Holy Habanero, I Clove You, Simmer Down, Well Seasoned, and Cinnamon Sticks. And this is what it looks like on the back and you get like a preview of the colors here. And as always you get this little card and it gives you step by step how to apply like the color gel application. And here we can see just what the colors are going to look like. The first gel that I will be starting with is called Cinnamon Sticks. Ooh, this is really pretty. So this is a lovely maroony, like a dark maroon. I do see some like brown undertones to it. It has a really nice pearl finish too. Like this is almost a one quarter, but I can see like some see-throughness at the tip. So I am going to go in with a second. See, and with that second coat, that sheerness that I was seeing in the tip is gone. So it's up to you. Could very easily get away with one coat with this um, polish. But for me personally, I think I get the coverage that I'm looking for and the opacity in two coats. And this is what Cinnamon Sticks looks like against my skin tone. It is such a beautiful color. I love colors like these guys like you can never go wrong and this is in two coats next up is a curry on just by the name I want to say like this is probably gonna be an orange And this is what Curion looks like in one coat. So this is a beautiful burnt orange. I will say like it's a burnt orange, but it does have some red undertones. It's pulling more red in my camera than it is in real life. That's for sure. This is another color that is absolutely perfect for the fall, winter seasons. Really and truly, you any of these colors all year round. It's really dependent on you, but you know what I mean. So I got really good opacity in one coat good coverage it applied like butter so i'm not gonna go in with a second coat with this one i'm just gonna leave it at one and here is what curry on looks like against my skin tone me personally just because of like my skin tone i wouldn't wear this it is still a very very nice color but just my preference is not something i would lean towards but i can actually see a lot of people wearing this and it looking amazing on them so this one is called holy habanero This is 
Holy Habanero with one coat. And this is a raspberry red. It does have some pinky undertones to it. It is still really pretty. I wouldn't consider this like a true red. To, though to be honest it does have like I said the pinky undertones but it is showing up true to life which is what I really like and this is just one coat so you get a really good coverage and op opacity with one coat so I'm not gonna go in with two and this is what holy habanero looks like against my skin tone very very beautiful color I do feel though that with the few collections that I have um, accumulated from light elegance that I've seen a few colors similar to this but Bear in mind, I don't have a lot of Light Elegance colors, but just from what I've collected so far, I've seen colors similar, but I don't think I have one that's exactly the same. Maybe in later videos, I'll start to do comparisons, but we'll see. But it's still a really, really nice color. Up next is I Clove You. This is I Clove You with just one coat. Look at the coverage, guys. So this to me is like a mocha brown, almost chocolate, not as dark as chocolate, but like you could still consider it in the brown family. It is very, very lovely. I don't usually lean towards browns, but I could definitely see myself getting use out of this. So I got really good opacity and coverage in just one coat, so I'm not gonna go in with a second one. And this is what I Clove You looks like against my skin tone. Again, I usually don't lean towards browns, but I am really, really liking this. Like, this is a really nice neutral brown. And the second last color I have to share with you is called Simmer Down. I was actually just laughing to myself because you know how many times I've told someone to simmer down when they're getting facey? Yeah, simmer down. <laughs> So this is a simmer down, beautiful like rosy maroony color. I love this. I can see some like purpley undertones to this, so it is very very pretty. I am seeing a bit of shadowing up here and like at the sides here, and I can see just a slight bit of sheerness at the tip. So I will be going in with a second coat, but maybe if I had gone in with just a bit thicker coat, I could have gotten away with one. So with that second coat, it really helped to fix the shadowing I was seeing here and along here and it gave it the opacity that I was looking for so I can't like see through the tip here. My camera is pink picking up more of the pinkly purpley undertone to it. It is a bit more muted than what it is showing up in the camera. And here is Simmer Down against my skin tone. I love this color. It is so beautiful. Again, it is pulling a bit lighter than it is in real life. It is a bit more muted, but it is still a lovely color regardless. And the last color from this six piece collection that I have to share with you is called Well Seasoned. Ooh, this is a gorgeous blue. Love, love, love.
have well seasoned in one coat so this is a beautiful fall blue i would say that it would work for fall and winter i can even see you getting use out of this in the springtime as well i am seeing a bit of sureness in the tip so i will go in with a second coat but again you could very easily stop at one it's just my personal preference And just as I said, that second coat really helped to fill in that sureness that I was seeing at the tip and just give it a bit more opacity that I was looking for. And last but not least, this is well seasoned against my skin tone. Such a beautiful blue. I know so many people that would love this color and want it on their nails as well. And again, it's great all year round, but especially for fall and winter. And here we have it for the Light Elegant Spice fall 2020 collection honestly guys all together i really really do love these colors i feel like they work perfectly for fall and although yes it was released for fall collection you can actually use these any time of the year this is a really nice blue especially for the winter and these colors will go so nicely with so many different nail arts so many different designs or if you just want a solid color on your nail so let me know what your thoughts are down below did you have a favorite color from this collection do you like these kind of colors are you more into brighter colors neutral colors let me know. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching this video and tuning in with me. As always, please do make sure to give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. I will leave all the products linked down below. And until next time, stay glamorous.